Hey guys, it's Sparkly Simmer and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 3 100 Baby Challenge Part 7, I believe. Yes, yes it is. Um, And in this part, we must, like, it is freaking crucial, you guys, that we get this car done and sold because we are gonna have freaking, ugh, <laughs> freaking quadruplets and we need to get the hell out of this house, like, fast 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 like fast and the furious fast <laughs> so yeah definitely uh, gonna do that and for now i need abby to go ahead and quickly have some canned soup and then she needs to start working on the body the engine and all that good stuff because as i said um we do need to get out of here by the time that um, we have the quadruplets. Or at least I'm hoping that we will be able to get it done by then. So let's just go ahead and... We're not going to spend money on that. I'll just have Abby repair that later on. Um, but I'm actually going to have Faye work out. Because she is a little chubbier than uh, I prefer. And I hope you guys don't get offended by that in any way. I just... I don't really like how Sims look when they're chubby and stuff in this game. So... Um, yeah, don't take that offensively in any way. And you guys, look at how cute Adriana. <laughs> she looks so adorable. Oh, God, she is one stud. So, come on, Abby Cakes. You need to start working on this car. You need to. Oh, and she wants to chat with Walter. Nice, all right. And we do need to get ourselves back on the dating website. Although we already are on there, we do need to get back on there. If you guys know what I mean. We have to start adding some more guys because let's see who our next victim is going to be. And all right, so we have Stuart checked off. Matthew checked off. Marquez checked off. Um, well, we have all these guys, so I guess we really don't need men right now, but... Pretty soon we are going to need men and wow, quadruplets. <laughs> Having quadruplets is gonna be so crazy. So um, I'm assuming that Faye is gonna be really like, like er, uh, like dirty when she comes uh back from uh when she when she's done working on the TV, working out with the TV. So I'll just have her go ahead and shower up and then sleep. And Abby, I'm sorry, girl, but you're going to have to listen to your tab cast. I totally forgot to have her do that first. Um, go ahead and listen to the writing tab cast. All right. Um, and for those of you for the, for those of you guys who didn't watch my update video, I will be going ahead and um, I will be going ahead and updating i will be going ahead and starting an all-in-one lp and i really hope you guys are excited for that i will be doing a uh, baby challenge and all-in-one and i will be creating a schedule for that eventually and she just skilled up she leveled up to skill level three in the writing in the writing skill wow that was quite the tongue twister there but um, I guess I will just get right back to you guys in the morning. Alright All right, guys, then. so it is the morning and I'm actually going to have Faye go ahead and wake up now because it is a time for her to wake up. And I did have her wake up or she woke up on her own and she had some pancakes. So I guess she really isn't hungry. I'll just have her go ahead and use the bathroom or flush it first. You know. Uh, use it and then she can go ahead and work out I guess or no she will get sweaty sweaty so I will just go ahead and have her scrap the painting and then work on what am I doing <laughs> work on a small painting that way she can just be a little bit artistic or can she tend the garden no nope, she can't um all right so Jesus Christ this freaking toilet is always getting screwed up like i don't even understand that and abby okay so she should be waking up in some time now so um i'm just gonna go ahead and quickly speed through this that way she can go ahead and repair this computer because it is just a mess 
a bloody, bloody mess. So I'm just going to have her go ahead and wake up now, I guess. It is morning and it is time for her to get up. So go ahead and... Ooh, first I need her to actually listen to the cooking tab cast. Maybe she does get on serving some breakfast. And she's going to go ahead and serve up some waffles. And then... Ooh, I'm not sure if Walter and Adrian. Ooh, guys, look at her tummy. It's big. It's huge. So, um, after she's done that, I'll just have her go ahead and shower up. That way she can be nice and clean. And then she will tend the babies once they wake up. And, yeah. And, Faye, what are you up to, girl? Uh, she wants to improve painting skill. I'm sure she's going to do that in a little bit. She's disgusted. Well, no wonder. Let's actually go ahead and replace this because this is just ill. Ill. Ill, ill, ill. So let's go ahead and replace it with odor-free toil toilet. Or, yeah. You, you know what? It'll do. It will do. So um, I guess when she's done painting, she can go ahead and mop up the puddle. That way we don't have much of a mess. And come on, Abby Cakes, you have so much to do today. So, so much to do. So little time. And as you guys can see, we have our car kind of like updated. I guess you can say we are almost done with it. And actually, we do. We are definitely planning on aging up Faye once she gets on the honor roll. Because um, it is about time she ages up. Although we... Yeah, and she's doing awesome in school. So hopefully she she gets on the honor roll today and we can age her up after school. So, Faye, come on. Come on, stop painting and go to school. It's time to go. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. But, oh, <laughs> what are you waiting for, girl? Come on. All right, thank you. Oh, my gosh. Your outerwear sucks or your school wear. What the heck? I never assigned you with that hairstyle. All right, then. Well, I guess I'm going to have to edit her when she ages up into a teen. And you guys, take a, a look at this. She actually completed a nice batch of freaking waffles without burning them up. So, awesome accomplishment. Clap, clap for that one. And, um, before she, she tends the babies, I'm going, oh, actually work hard, very hard, uh, that way she can get, yeah, so, quickly, quickly eat, come on, should not take that long, and how many lifetime happiness points do we have, actually, um, we have 10,560, all right, and I think we should be getting a lot more once, once we have a baby, but I'm not sure. Um, so, I want to give her the Master of Sedu Seduction, and that's 15,000, so we are pretty close to that one, so hopefully we can get there pretty soon, and just, you know what, shower, and then, yeah, shouldn't take too long. This shower, this walker is just, like, in the middle of everything. Crazy. And as you guys can see, the fall weather is merging in, and we are slowly going into spring. And, ooh, there's a rainbow. I, I hardly ever get to see a, a rainbow in Storybrooke, but I, I don't know. I like it. Um, so both of the toddlers are awake, so we're going to go ahead and... Uh, okay, can can my game load, please? Thank you. Thank you. Um, so Abby, go ahead, and what do they need? Um, they're hungry, uh, pretty much everything. <laughs> so go ahead and attack with the claw, beat on the floor, tickle him and snuggle him, and then go ahead and do the same for her. And for some reason, the last time I fed her on the floor, it didn't work and she was still starving. And I, that's an issue I keep having in the Sims 3 with my toddlers. It's, I really don't get it. I don't get it but you know it is what it is and you know what <laughs> we, oh wait we have to pay the bills all right so go ahead and do that afterwards and can we please please like sign off of this uh newsletter thing 
check weekly events. How do we do this? I totally forgot. Totally forgot. I am such a freaking noob at that. At doing that. Come on. Come on. Anytime now. We do need to get working on the car. So um, what she can just put her down. And then go ahead and work on the body. The engine. Definitely the engine. A lot. A lot. A lot. And ooh. Vile surroundings. This room is so fetid and foul. Yeah. This house is pretty nasty. So... I don't think the government is going to be paying us a lot of money for keeping it dirty. So we're actually going to have to clean that up sometime today. Alright, so, um, come on, girl. Come on, come on. Don't tell me you're still hungry. Don't tell me you're still hungry. Why are you teaching her how to talk? Don't do that yet. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. <laughs> And you, do you guys see what I mean? We just fed her on the floor and she's still not satisfied. I don't understand why this happens. Go ahead and feed her on the floor again. And then go and work on the engine a lot. And then the body. Alright. Sounds good. Hopefully it doesn't take too long for her to do that. Um, and she should be having the babies in this part. So. Oh my god. I am preparing myself. <laughs> I am preparing myself for these quadruplets that are going to be coming along. It is going to be a crazy, crazy ride. Definitely. <laughs> so, yeah. Faye, yeah, she should she should be getting home in a few hours. Um, but, yeah. Go ahead and speed through that. Go ahead and do that real quick. And you're hungry, too? What the heck? We just fed you, child. We just fed you. Well, are you... Uh, you're almost done with it, so come on, finish quickly, and then you can go ahead and feed freaking Walter, because he tends to be hungry a lot of the time. These toddlers do, so... I don't even know what's wrong with them. They're always freaking hungry. Starved. Freaking fat asses. <laughs> Sorry, but not gonna lie. They, uh, we, we are all fat asses in our own ways, you know. We live for food. So, come on, Abby. Come on. You should be done anytime. Anytime. So, let's just go ahead and give him some food. And then, uh, we should get back on the car. We should. So, go ahead and keep working on the body and the engine. And then, um, I will get back to you guys. Once Faye is home and, uh, I guess some, yeah, we'll get back to you guys when she's home. All right, guys. So Faye is home and let's see, let's see. You didn't, oh, okay. Well, why aren't you on the honor roll? Oh my Lord. Oh my Lord. I don't even know why she isn't on the honor roll. All right, go ahead and do your homework. I don't, I don't get this. Doing homework can help kids discover how to learn on their own or how to get out of doing things when they don't want to do. Um, well, dude. Ugh, can you just get the honor roll, please? You have an A. She has an A. I don't know why she isn't getting the honor roll. Crazy. And it is Friday, so we have the entire weekend to age Faye up and have her um, help us out. With the babies once she is a teenager, which we should be doing pretty soon. This is so crazy. It is taking forever. You know, I might cheat on her. I might, and I might just age her up with or without her honor roll. I'm sorry, guys, but this is... I don't understand why she doesn't have her honor roll. I don't get it. So she's just going to work on the car for a little while longer. Hopefully she finishes with that one last task and then i will have her go ahead and um rev engine and then faye you are yes going to once again work out and lose some pounds and then you will shower up shower up yep and then she will continue painting that way she can get her skills up and all that good stuff and adriana what's up girl you got a potty really got a potty all right, I see, I see, I see. So, come on, Abby Flakes. 
finish up there so we can get a move on with these babies. For some reason, they don't need attention. Oh, wait. Yeah, they don't. That's strange. Probably because we fed them two bottles when they weren't supposed to be fed two bottles. And if this part... Oh, holy crap. Holy crap, the babies are coming. The babies are coming. What? Oh, my gosh. Okay. Prepare for this moment. Oh, God, and she's not in the best mood, but whatever. Have the babies already, Abby. <laughs> I want to see if we got four plits. I mean, four plits. What the hell? <laughs> Quadruplets. <laughs> so, go ahead and see if we got them babies. Come on, come on. And she, poor girl, she's in the rain. Freaking Stuart, bro. If you are calling us, I'm going to smack you in the face and just... Oh, my God. Abby, have the freaking babies. Well, she has, she's having quadruplets or triplets, so... I, I don't blame her for taking such a long time. Probably quite painful for her. Um, So, come on. Come on. Come on. Abby... All right, whatever. Um, Faye is almost done. Oh, no, she's not. She just started. Oops. Okay. <laughs> well, she's going to finish roll eight. Um, Abby, have the freaking babies. All right. So, congratulations on a new baby boy. Pregnancy has its up and ups and downs, but Ab Abby managed to make the best of it. The baby was born with the easily impressed and absent-minded traits. What would you like to name him? All right, well, I have some names here, um, and I'm going to go ahead and choose the first one on here, which is Cole. I like that name. I wrote a ton down. Congratulations on a new baby girl. Pregnancy has its ups and downs, but man Abby managed to get the best of it. The baby was born with a genius and athletic traits. Awesome. What would you like to name her? All right, well, I do have a list of different... Oops. Okay, what's going on here? All right, so let me get my notebook real quick. And all right, so my next one was going to be Emma. So let's go ahead and give her that name. And she was born with some pretty good traits. All right, so we have <laughs> we have triplets so far. Hopefully it's not or I don't know. Um, so she was a another baby girl, and she was born with the friendly and virtuoso trait. So. She's going to be named, um, April. All right, April. Don't tell me we had another one. Oh, my God. We had another baby, and it's a boy. <laughs> and he was born with the athletic and light sleeper traits. All right, well, um, Kyle. That was going to be my next name on here. Oh, my God. Holy crap. <laughs> Oh my god, we had quadruplets. <laughs> quadruplets, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. I'm scared. I did not think I was gonna be this scared, but I'm freaking bloody scared. Oh my gosh. All right, well, um, I'm actually going to go ahead and quickly renovate this area, and then I will get right back to you guys. All right, guys, so I went ahead and redid the room. I really didn't have to renovate the size or anything like that because we only have one, two, three, four, five, six babies, and six cribs are perfectly fine for us right now. So I'm just going to stick with the six cribs. And what you guys see I have done is I just went ahead and changed the wallpaper. Added two extra windows and then changed up the style. That way I don't have to deal with, you know, girl beds, boy beds, all that stuff. So um, if you guys want me to change it, I will. But for now, that's just what I'm putting. Um, and damn four babies I did not think it would be you know I don't know I, I, I I'm just scared <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say I'm scared so I'm gonna go ahead and edit all these babies in creative mode and I will get right back to you guys 
All right, so I went ahead and worked on all of them in creative mode, but I only changed their skin tone because, um, I, guys, we're gonna be having a hundred babies, and I can't be changing their outfits every single time, um, she gives birth. So, um, all I'm gonna be changing is the skin tone, and hopefully I can get that figured out, though. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and have her, um, pick up, pick her up. Is she gonna do it on her own? Is she? Put in crib. All right. So she is going to do that on her own. And is everyone else well attended? Well, right now she's attending Emma, isn't she? Yep. Um, and then Kyle, you are starving, poor child. So I'm gonna have her go ahead and give him a bottle. And what else does he need? Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So she's just gonna go ahead and give him a bottle. And then, um, Aww, we should be, we should put everyone else to bed, though. So, um, Walter, how you feeling, boy? Well, he's gonna have to potty, so, ooh, oh, wait, here it is. <laughs> what am I saying? Um, I thought we had no potty chair, so go ahead and quickly potty, Walter. And then, Abby, we need to get our next guy on the line, but first, before we we worry about that we're gonna have to get this car done full show so yeah um and then once walter's done using the potty she can go ahead and do the same thing as well um adriana can so do you guys see this glitch that keeps happening with my game i i, I don't get it what's up emma what's wrong you're hungry go ahead and feed her give her a bottle and then play with her and then Put her back in the crib. Oh my god, you guys. This is gonna be such a crazy challenge. <laughs> what did I sign myself up for? I don't even know. Um, so go ahead and put April in the crib. And then, um... She is so stinky. But before she showers, I'll just have her go ahead and have some leftover waffles. Alright, so... Um, I'll have her shower after she's done that. And then... Um, Walter, just come over here, dude. That way your sister can go ahead and potty, too. So, Adriana, go ahead and potty. Use potty chair. And then I'm gonna have to have... Can Faye do it? Empty. Go ahead and empty that, Faye. Um, has she lost weight? I honestly don't know. Um, but anyhow, I found out that the way your, your sims, your children get honor roll is if they get three straight A's in... Uh, school and she's only gotten two straight A's so far so all she needs is one more until she gets honor roll so I'm just gonna wait I'm gonna be patient and I'm gonna wait the weekend um, <laughs> which is gonna be hard I'm gonna admit it's going to be one tough weekend because it's gonna be Abby on her own you guys it's gonna be Abby on her own so it's just it's gonna be crazy um, all the babies are currently attended and they're sleeping freaking awesome, <laughs> awesome, awesome. So when she has done that, she's just going to go ahead and shower up and wow, she is, she's so tired. So I'll just have her go ahead and are they hungry actually? Um, wait, one thing I want to do real quick, go ahead and head. Oh, do you guys see this right now? Wow. Crazy. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and go into City Hall, Enra's, Portrait Panel, Total Reset? What? I guess I'll do that off camera, um, cause what I wanna do is I want to have the Portrait Panel list out all the sims, um, like, do you guys know what I mean in order, rather than just randomly moving them whenever we give birth to a new one or add a new one to our household? Walter, how are you feeling, dude? Hygiene? What? Okay, whatever. Um, we're gonna put him in bed, actually, once we are done showering. Um, why can't we do that? What, you're, you're too stinky to put your son in the, in the crib? Um, go ahead and just feed on the floor and then put him in the crib. And then do the same with Adriana real quick. Um, feet on floor and then put her in the crib and then we will be heading off to bed 
So hopefully we can get this done pretty, 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 pretty soon. Um, chat with Adriana. Share, I guess. And how many lifetime points do we have now? 13,808. So, um, we should be getting 15,000 soon. And we will be getting the Master of Sedu Seduction, um, lifetime little happiness points rewards. I always get mixed up with that. But, um, go ahead and quickly attend your babies. <laughs> your little babies. Guys, this is crazy. Look at all the babies we have. Six babies. Um, and in the, in the morning, I'm just gonna have her automatically head to, um, working on the car. Um, it is 11, 11, 8 p.m. Oh, gosh. Go ahead and send Adriana to bed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You have to do this. Um, pick up Adriana. Pick her up and then put her on the bed. All right. Poor Abby, you guys. She has to go through all this crap. And Faye, get the hell Like, what are you doing? Alright, so go ahead and put her in the crib. Can we put her in the crib now? Can we put her in the crib now? Dude, put her in the crib. What is going on? Feet on floor, change outfit, attack with the claw. I'm sorry, are there no cribs available? What is wrong with this one? Dude, come on. Come on. Ah, oh, this is, this is just crazy. Pick up Adriana. Pick her up and put her in the frick crib. This is, why? I don't get why we can't put her in the crib. Um, you know what? Let her pass out on the floor. <sighs> glitches, glitches, glitches. Um, so go ahead and head to bed. And then I will get back to you guys in the morning. And I, I have a lot of things to take care of, like Faye and all that stuff. So, yeah, I will definitely get back to you guys in the morning. And, yeah. Actually, I'm going to be ending this part here because it has gone on long enough. So, I will get back to you guys in my next part. Be sure to stay tuned for that because it will be up sometime soon. Probably tomorrow, but I'm not sure. Um, I could be wrong. I It might be up sooner. So, yeah, I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye, guys.